Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome, I'm Casey Edwin. I'm going to walk you through one of my absolute favorite plugins that is going to be Mini Grand. So, I'm just going to jump really into it very quickly. This is by Air. Now, I would normally drop some sort of a link to let you know where to purchase it. For this one, I mean, it really depends on where you want to go so and what the prices are so like adsr sometimes will have it for like 20 bucks i wouldn't buy it the normal price i think it's like 60 or something like that it's silly because basically you can find it anywhere for a lot lower so i think i've seen it at plugin boutique or something as low as five dollars i think i've seen 10 15 stuff like that I wouldn't pay full price. That's what I'm trying to say. It's worth it, but I wouldn't pay it. Okay, so let's take a look at it. We are going to go through a lot of the presets. So it's default right here. Look at all these presets. Pretty fantastic. And as you can see, it is very customizable. You can get the mix here, the room, and we got the dynamic response and the model. So these all kind of different, give it a different flavor. And then right here, we got different room sizes. I mean, you get the general idea. Now for the volume, I feel like I always have to turn the volume all the way up to really get a stronger sim uh, signal. Now I'm sure if you add some sort of compressor, compression, compression, or something to it, you can get that volume up more, but the stock, you're gonna wanna jack that up if you're not gonna mess with anything. So we are going to just go through, I am gonna come over here to my keyboard, I'm gonna start at default, and let's see what this thing sounds like. See, we're already getting kind of quiet, let's turn that up. Okay. I'll give it a little more volume. So it's got a nice, nice sound to it. And that's just the default. That's not even with going crazy with anything. All right, let's jump over. Let's go to ballad. A little more volume here. See, it's really cool because considering that it is a basic kind of VST, so you're not running it through contact, you can just kind of run it as is, which is fantastic. And you get a really realistic sound, all things considered. I mean, it's got kind of a, there you go. Let's go a little higher. This keyboard I'm using only has a couple octaves. Okay. So... You get the general idea there. Adjust something really quick. Pull this up a little. There we go. Okay, so now let's take a look at the next. Let's see what bright is. Oh, there it sounds bright. along. Some of these are a little aggressive. I mean, you might have a use for this. I don't personally know. It's very 
very aggressive. So let's move on. Let's see. Nice atmosphere. Let's see what the atmosphere sounds like. And as you can see, these are adjusting as we go. So it's giving us different presets. So if this is hall and atmosphere, go to hard and that's soft and hard. It's kind of funny. So it adjusts as it goes. So let's see atmosphere. Oh, that's pretty, right? A little muddier on the low end. No surprise there. Let's see how high this thing goes. Oof. Even sounds good up here. That's as high as that is gonna, is gonna go. All right, so that's kind of the atmosphere there. Dance piano, I don't think I've used this one. Let's see. Yep, that's about right. Yep. Kind of a nice feel to it. All right. Oh, this one's going to probably have a lot of reverb. So I like that. And let's give it some pop. Adjust this volume a little. itself my computer is not really the strongest in the world okay bright pop a little more upbeat i guess Ooh, here we go something fun that a lot. I like really reverby sounds, so that's not a surprise. Let's see what their upright piano sounds like. By the way, sorry to plug it in the middle, but if you want to support me, check out my music, Casey Edwin. Anywhere you want to listen to it, I'll drop the solo.tv link to link in the description also subscribe like all that jazz if you want to help me out so let's keep going Do a light ambience. How about that?
That is a light ambiance. That is accurate. I like that a lot. Ooh, concert front row. sound. So. All right, there we go. By the way, I use this in a lot of my songs. So if you want to hear this in the mix, again, I know I keep plugging my music but check it out, a lot of my songs use this piano. It's the introspective. Cool. Here's one I really love, the love scene. All right. keeping it pretty basic. Most of what I'm playing is just in you know, C, but I'm just showing this off anyway. Oof, that's pretty, right? Okay, there's a closed lid. Lights out in the studio. Underwater. I think I used this in one of my songs for my Halloween album, I believe. It's got kind of a nice haunting vibe. Empty stadium. Oof. Okay. Oh yeah, that sounds accurate. All right, that is Mini Grand by Air. Again, if you'd like to support me, Casey Edwin, check out my music, hit that sub, give me a like, and share this video with people. All right, peace out, folks.